Bursting with gift ideas for every swimmer. Swimoutlet.com. Search for that unique stocking stuffer or perfect holiday surprise. As always, low price guarantee and free shipping on $49. Swimoutlet.com. Give the gift of swim this season. Longhorn coach Eddie Reese called me last Thursday. This is his message. Mel, if you're bored, you might want to come down to practice on Friday. Could be interesting. It was interesting and fast. It was a descending speed set, all off the blocks, suited up. 600 IM, 600 free, 300 IM, 300 of each stroke, 150 IM, 150 of each stroke, 100 IM, 100 of each stroke, 50s, all strokes. They apparently do this every year, and this practice is unofficially known as the Eddie Reese Invite. Six hundred free. The fastest time we've had is five twenty-six, and we're gonna holy mackerel! They are gonna go way faster. Traditionally speaking, um, we have a two-day tri meet with Michigan and Indiana. And we've done it for years and years and years. Friday, we've done a regular dual meet. On Saturday, we've done what we've always got a nickname, the Eddie Reese Invite. And this year, we decided uh, we had to to that many squad meet. And so, uh, there wasn't really an opportunity to do the Eddie Reese Invite. We split the meet into two days, which I'm half the NCAA order on uh, Friday and second half on Saturday against those teams. And we had an opening on our schedule in mid-November without a meet, and we needed to race. So, uh, we just decided to do our own little Eddie Reese Invite. It's sort of a Intra squad meet without scoring it like an orange and white. Any time we have the opportunity to race and get away from just training day in and day out, it's fun. We, there's always people who are racers and there's people who are trainers. And uh, in an ideal world, they kind of merge and they train and race. And so this gives an opportunity for those who are racers to step up and those who are train, training trainers to find out where they're at in the season. 243, 243 in the 300 fly. 148.5 on the way, right? 148.5 out. That's up to you. Rolls on out. 148.5. 52. 5 or 6. I guess I'm a little better than when Michigan. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. 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 What's he trying to break? 240, which is going to be really tight. That's uh, 53, 35 or something for 100. Boom! Nice finish, Jack. This one of the Well I haven't really been able to push a two back and a speedo too hard. I've been been lifting a lot um, this year, along with keeping up the intensity of uh, training. So. Um, I think things are really starting to look good and set themselves up nicely for a month from now at Invite. Liam Lockwood just won the men's 300 breaststroke. There you go, Liam. All right, so lane three is Brett Ringel, uh, who's a freshman from in the South Lake area of Dallas. Uh, he's primarily a 50, 100 freestyler, but we do a distance day and he did a thousand free and did three dolphins up every wall and I've told Mel he'll do that up every wall here and so far he's sticking to it and he's at the uh, 150 and 116 eight. so we shall see. We're going to check the kicks, we're yeah, counting the kicks.
workouts. They were able to finish like that. That's really good. because Eddie Reese apparently can be bribed by people who are swimming fast. And we are scrapping the 100 fly, 100 back, 100 breast, 100 free, and going straight into the 50. So the cycle that was supposed to be 300, 150, 150 has become 300, 150, 50. We dropped 100. People are happy. We probably ought to leave on that note on a Friday. Hopefully they're happy after their 50 as well. And it's a good thing probably for all. A lot of fast swims. Thus far. Jack Conger's coming out of the backstroke area of swimming. He, and he has challenged Joseph to a 50 fly. <laughs> I, I, don't, I have my opinion on how that's going to turn out. What do you think? Uh, Joseph is really good is a really good kicker but they will race it'll be fun so on this side of the pool lane go. five is trip cooper who is a senior lane six is sophomore jack conger right, and lane seven who volunteered to do this by the way he's supposed to be in the backstroke cycle he wants to race and lane seven is joe schooling who's our freshman so here we go 50 fly going to swim off their tie in the 50 fly. 20.98. pretty fast considering they've, they've, they've swum all the... It's fast can, no matter who you are, where you are. Comment? Do you have a pre-race comment? What? Do you have a pre-race comment? No comment. No comment? No comment. Uh -oh, you got a pre-race comment on the swim off? I'm going to kick his ass. No comment still? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. the winner of the 50 butterfly. The main record was 20.98 seconds. Held by lane four, Joe Schooling, and get up! Jack Conger. Let's go! Let's go, Joe, Jack! Step up. Time to start. Awesome. <laughs> they both missed the finish. It was still fast. Right. 
No, we're going 50 back now. Yeah, let's go. Yes, we are. Let's go. We do this meet because there is a hole in the schedule, but also to find out where we are. So we make them swim three or four events and all hard. And hopefully it comes out like this. We know we've had a great October and November of training. We've got our invite coming up and we've got a number of people. We'd like to make cuts there and I want to find out where they are. And as you can see, they have fun with this. Fun and fast, nothing like it. It was a lot of fun. There's nothing wrong with having Friday. Uh, fun, especially after a long week of school, and uh, here we go into the weekend. So, well done by the guys, we're happy. We sure appreciate Swim Swam being here to film it all. Thank you. Good race. Good. Joe, any comments? I need taper. 